Next tonight, here the deadly police shooting of a teenager in Connecticut, a 15-year-old boy allegedly ramming an officer with a stolen car. And now, new video showing the moments after police opened fire. Here's ABC's Lindsay Davis. These images, taken by a bystander, are raising questions tonight. 15-year-old Jason Negron handcuffed on the ground with his head facing to his right. The camera pans off, and four seconds later, Negron's head is in a different position. The victim's family says the picture suggests Negron was still alive, and they say that contradicts what police told them, that Negron was killed when he was shot. According to Bridgeport, Connecticut police, the officer shot Negron after he refused orders to stop, and he hit an officer with a stolen car on Tuesday. It's a, a young man who put himself in a really bad situation and lost his life. The 21-year-old passenger was also shot, but suffered non-life-threatening injuries. The police chief says Negron's body was lying in the street for about six hours after the shooting for evidence-gathering reasons. But Negron's family members say the police never provided him medical attention that they believe might have saved his life. <laughs> Hundreds gathered last week to pay tribute to the teen and call for action. That officer is on administrative leave pending the outcome of an investigation.